let's talk a little bit more about the origins of the Star Gods. So no one really knows for sure how the Necrons first made contact with the Catan. It may have been through researching dying suns, a freak chance encounter, and some even believe that their hatred for the Old Ones acted like a beacon for the Catan. However it happened, the Necrons had found something truly horrifying. Beings of pure energy whose forms were so vast that they dwarfed even planets, and a consciousness so great it was incomprehensible to mortals. How the Necrons even managed to communicate with them is still unknown. The physical forms of the Catan that we're used to seeing in the game were made by the Necrons. They were made of Necrodermis, so the Catan would have a physical body to inhabit. And the first Catan to come to the Necrons was none other than the Deceiver. And he is aptly named. The Deceiver told the Necrons that they also had a deep hatred of the Old Ones, and the Catan would offer their assistance in eradicating them. He also promised to rid them of their cursed radiated form and grant them immortality. It's because of him that the Necron Tear became the Necrons. 